Hey, what's up guys? I'm AvalancheFan133 and I'm back in my NHL 14 goalie be a pro mode. Uh, this episode I'm facing the Minnesota Wild in game number 53. This season is going by so fast. Game number 53 on the season at home. Uh, 12 games have passed in between episodes. I went 2-6. and six. Only I started 8 of them. I'm surprised I start, started that many. But after the 3-1 win against the Flyers, we lost 3-1 to the Islanders without me and Nett. Then we lost 3-1. 3-1 always uh, against the Sabres with me and Nett. I think I did pretty good. I think the third goal might not have been against me. It might have been an empty netter. I don't know. I don't remember. It's so long ago. Uh, then we won 3-2 against the Blue Jackets. And we lost 3-2 against the Red Wings. I can't remember what happened in these games now. Uh, it's been a little while. I played a bunch like right after last episode, but uh, six to two win against the Panthers right after the All-Star game. We had uh, Gulagoski and Jamie Ben uh, named to the All-Star team. Nobody else. Then we lost eight to five against the Montreal Canadiens. I do remember my defense just, eh. <laughs> just giving up. And then I had a nice bounce back loss against the um, Senators, two to one loss. Whenever I do so well, my offense is terrible. I don't know why. Then we won six to four against the New Jersey Devils. Lost four to three against the New York Islanders. Uh, that was a fun game. It was a tough game. I think they scored pretty late to win it. Um, then we lost three to one against the Rangers. We lost a lot of games. Lost two to one against the Flyers. One to nothing against the Blues. And here we are against the Wild. Ugh. So I've made my numbers a tad bit better. I do have a new career high in wins. Eight wins. That's good. I want to get that to double digits. I want it to be more. At least closer to 500. 8 and 14, I don't like. But it's not all me. Most of it isn't me. I'm one person. I need my team to play better. Um, do, do, do. I took away my 5 hole boost. And I put it on um, rebound control. We'll look at that in a second. But I felt like I could use the rebound control more, so I took that off. I got the stick high up. I don't remember what else I done, but that's all my reflexes. My rebound control is now at 90 thanks to the plus 5. That's really needed. Glad I did that. Uh, well, I don't know if... I, I'm going to keep it like that for now. And just agility. I believe, yeah, I just won agility on athletic. And and that pretty much does it. Uh, we'll just start it up as I talk about where we're at in the standings. I believe we're in 11th place. Uh, we do have some injuries. Uh, yeah, we'll see that on the loading screen. Uh, 11th place in the West. Seven points out of eighth, which is the playoff spot. And that's our offense. There's our defense. Our defense has taken a hit. Uh, Daly's down again. Anyways, they're standing. Seven points out, but we do have two games in hand. I think Vancouver's holding that eighth spot. So we might be able to make up some ground. Uh, need to switch that back to high. <laughs> it's playing a little. I was actually jumping into the Hockey Ultimate team a little bit tonight. Tried that out and got a little bored. <laughs> I haven't liked the gameplay of the last few... Uh, NHL titles just it feels frustrating and annoying that against the AI I don't know I don't know how to explain it <laughs> but I get frustrated easily I haven't had fun in really big fun uh, in the full team control since NHL 10 I love that game and players to watch Suter and Erickson hopefully we can scratch out a win I also just watched, um, I didn't watch it live, I just watched it, yeah, we have Daly, Dylan, and Nemeth out, that's bad. I just watched the United States and Russia game, wow, that was exciting, especially that shootout, 
Let's see, TJ Oshie of the Blues went like six times and scored in four of them. That was just awesome. I loved it. Hey everybody, I'm Gary Thorne. I did not know that, that you can keep using the same player in the International Olympics, unlike the NHL where you have to keep switching players. I guess you, there's going to be a point where everybody play, everybody has a turn, and they need to start going again, I guess. I guess they just start from the top again. I've never seen that before. Oh, good chance. Harding's in net for them. Not Backstrom. Not sure why. Maybe they're just giving Harding a start or Backstrom's injured. I didn't see anything on the injuries. But anyways, Erickson with a good shot that trickled away from the goalie. If somebody had been there, could have been an easy goal, but nobody was there. So far, some good defense. I don't think I've faced a shot yet. Jamie Ben, that is Ben, right? I keep getting Ben and Riley Smith's numbers mixed up. Now I'm thinking that's Smith. I don't remember. 18 and 14, for some reason in my brain, is too similar. Comes Minnesota. Pominville getting pinned in the corner. Goligoski has it, skates it out. Wow. Defense doing very well so far. Just hopefully we can get some offense. I can't get the best of both worlds at all, really. I'm really hoping we can make the playoffs. Oh, there's a first shot. I was going to try to throw that to my right, but it did not allow me. Four and six in the last ten. I don't know why. I started like seven in a row. Ooh, two big saves. I started like seven in a row for some reason. Harry Letton is perfectly healthy. Okay. I'm trying not to uh, try to cover too much because it backfires so much. The goalies are so terrible at covering. Yeah. <laughs> Two-minute power play. Here we go. 13th rank. A I think we got a little lower percent than uh, last year. Last year we had, like, the number one power play. Oh, yeah, I do remember um, going out to get one of those pucks in one of my previous games, and passing it right to somebody. I think it was the New Jersey game, actually. My 6-4 to four win against New Jersey. I was so mad at myself for that. I should not try to pass as a goalie unless it's... I don't know. I have to really be alert where I can pass it and such. Suter will get that out. He's playing for Team USA. I really want to see uh, U.S. Canada. Oh, there's another big penalty. I've not watched any of the Canadian games. I do have one recorded on my DVR that I plan to watch eventually. Forgot who it's against. <laughs> but I haven't really watched anybody other than the United States so far. There's so many games going on. So exciting. Five on three for 24 seconds we have. Heatley will get boarding on Morrow. Good thing he's all right. Okay, Ben is 14. It was Riley Smith I was looking at. That's so annoying. I don't know why I keep getting those two mixed up. Could really use a goal here. Five on three for a little bit longer. Oh, glove save. And missed it. <laughs> I don't know why the goalies miss it like that sometimes. A lot of the times, I should say. Goes, I think this is Larson. I'm not... I'm not... So super familiar with the numbers. I know the big names. Erickson, that stuck right away at 21. Smith and uh, Ben, I know generally it's one of those two. Larson's 36, got to remember that. Erickson with a big check back there. I'm not going to be able to get that one. So it's looking like I'm going to get pretty far through, especially with wanting to play more uh, pretty far through this, uh, this time in my Be a Pro series. Oh, come on. Just stick your stick out. Uh, unlike the last series that I had on NHL 13, I got kind of uh, a bit bored. 
uh, at the end. So I kind of just dropped it. And uh, NHL 14 was coming out at that time, so. Solid as you can make it. Everybody enjoys this except the guy that just got hit. Yeah. <laughs> and they've got that puck now in the offensive zone off the draw. Minnesota Hopefully, I just want to have a chance a in the playoffs. Chance, so they it off. Good job. My second season with the Stars. I didn't make the playoffs in the. Oh. And yet another I didn't make the playoffs with Halifax, right did I? I don't think I did. <laughs> it seems so long ago. Under I'm pretty sure I did. No didn't make the playoffs for a season with the Stars. Go Second with. season was starting off good, but now we're going to have to really fight and get a good Pretty winning good streak right going it, but it ends up in the for a chance. Oh, boy. And I could not get over more. Man, defensive slip there. Nobody covering. Crab, was it? Yeah. It's a good one and it's a goal. Well, this would have been a highlight reel save had he made it with his glove. It was a good shot. I just he skated a bit to his right and I was not ready for that. I was anticipating that glove side. Minnesota's and beat me with that glove. My glove is not my best. Yeah, now the question is thing. can they build on it, Gary? Because bit of a mistake by me. Winner. Bigger mistake by my oh, defense. Overall, I think Partially, it wasn't fully paying attention. Well, that hurts. They take the early lead. After all the offense we had on those power plays and all, it stinks. Erickson picks that off. Larson has it. Slapper on. Good save. Smith with another shot. Another save. Oligoski over to Larson. Good save again by Harding. Harding's performance in this game so Boy. far, and there we saw it again, has been solid. Single-handedly I mean, keeping Minnesota with the lead. Beverly will take the face off and win it. So good at those. Ugh. Glove save by Harding, and we'll do it again. 5:49 left here in the first. Beverly again will win it, and uh, some more shots and some more saves for Harding. Jeez. And you know what? When you're under attack, I don't know how many shots we have, but there's been a lot already. Parise over to Suter. He'll just kind of skate around and finally get out of trouble. Almost turn it over, and it does finally land in our possession, and we'll dump it in. And Larson has it to Peverley. Skolikowski, we are dominating in the offensive zone, but cannot put one in. Come on. It's been so good. 401 left. Harding's going to have a ton of shots and saves by the end, even if he allows one. Allows a goal. Smith. Oh, there will be another penalty. I will not be able to get to the bench. Smith got slashed. Already 0 for 2 with 4 shots. Hopefully we can make it 1 for 3. And Harding will make another save. Sheesh. So many shots. Those are the moment. These are the kind of things I want to happen to me. My team up 1-0 and I'm getting tons of shots and keeping my team in it. Every goalie wants to be counted on by their teammates and the whole team. But you do want to have some support. Goal support, defensive support, everything. Morrow to Chasen. Back to Morrow. Slapper on. Rings it off the post and in. I love seeing that water bottle go flying. It's rolling around back behind the net. Joe Morrow. Chasen and Peverly with the assists. What a rocket. Harding could have came out a little more. Dinged it right off the post. We're all tied up before the end of the first. That's a big key. Could have been a good momentum boost for them taking the... Uh, lead into the break and I had to make a save there and another one okay 
That team's given up a few good chances. I probably don't have a lot of episodes left in this season since I probably won't start a whole lot of games. I assume I'll start near 30 games, and we have about 30 games left. Uh, got some one around there. So now I'm forgetting where I'm going with this. Oh, uh, I'll pro I think I might have one more episode in the season before the playoffs or wrap-up video. That's what I would assume. There's a chance also something will happen like last season where I just don't get started at all during, down the stretch and it might just pop up. I don't know. 20 shots, 19 saved by Harding. That's seven shots and six saved by me. Disappointing giving up that one goal, but it wasn't too terrible. It was... Ah, I just got to forget about it. Keep playing. It was kind of just a bad luck goal. Ugh, big hit there. Ooh, almost turned over in front of Harding and bends in after it. He's got it. Oh, he just missed it with that shot, that backhander. Back behind the net for Erickson. He's going to get pinned. He'll get that to Ben. Ben will lose it to Spurgeon. And Parise will get the pass from him. Comes Zach Parise. Pass across. Got blocked. Wasn't expecting that pass. Got to be on my toes. And they're offside. 17.39 left. They're out hitting us 12 to 5. So at least they have something going for them. They have not gotten any offense going, really. It's the one turnover that they capitalized on that if I had been in better position, I could have stopped it. And turnover to Peverly. He rung it off the post and somehow that stayed out. I don't know how. I really, it must have been on the line. I don't know if it was the defender or Harding who kept that out. Wow. Frazier gets bumped off the puck. Gilbert has it. Getting hounded by Frazier. He'll get that over to Setaguchi, and Setaguchi will turn it over in the neutral zone, and here comes Riley Smith. Shot on. Easy save by Harding, and we'll get another faceoff in their zone. Man, I haven't had anything happening here in my zone. 22 to 7, we're out shooting them. I could, I could enjoy a nice, easy game. Although that Flyers game last episode was nice and easy too. Kind of boring. But I could, I'm kind of due for some easy games. <laughs> after some of those rough ones. I'm really hoping as my goalie gets better, I will do better. Oh, I thought that was one of their players for a second. Or I'll start putting up a little better numbers at least. At this point, I've almost given up on thinking that I'll get regular numbers. Yeah, that'll actually stand. Uh, I just feel like this game's a little out of balance for me to put up Rego and I'm just, I don't know. I'm still going to try. I'm still going to enjoy it and just and just play. <laughs> Big save on Parise there. I'm a little tiny bit rusty. I maybe should have played a game, played this game or something beforehand. Oh, man, what is with my defense? Turn it over, I think. Unless that was a pass well, to the point. I don't know, but they're just... They do, Gary. What a shot. When Minnesota gets in the zone, they get a chance and they put it home. Nobody covering that guy. I had, what was that, Morrow or... Yeah, that was Morrow on my right, who should have been covering him. But either way, turnovers will kill you. Two to one, Minnesota, and we are dominating this game, but doing a terrible job of just in our own end. The bonus is, and good thing is, that we don't have much time in our own end. But here comes Minnesota. Oh, that got deflected wide, that pass, and that was almost given up. Very dangerous opportunity there. Jason has it. I don't have any doubts that my team will not 
tie this or tie this or ah, I just confused myself with my words. I have full He'll belief that my team will tie this. With only one goal lead. Just we need to tighten up defensively and stop turning it over. Matt Frazier doing a little dance and slapping it on eventually. Harding will cover after saving it. And back on that one shot that kind of, I think, ran off the crossbar and then landed on the line and somehow stayed out. That could have been made us 2-1. to one. Boy, somehow holding on to that puck. I don't know who that was. Dumped in. Golagasi's getting pinned. Gave it up and then taken back away. And Larson will get pinned now. Fight for it. Ooh, got out to get that blocker save. I've gotten a little better for those wraparounds. Crab, who had the goal, he lost it. Right now I'm worried more about overall goals than my save percentage because my goals against average is terrible. And I just want to win. And we will have to kill a penalty. After I assume will be called in a high stick. Parise gets bumped off. Nice defensive play by Moro. Unlike that other one that caused a goal. Oh, they're ranked 30th at 10.9%. Ooh, that might have been tipped on. Made the pad save. Gilbert. Oh, it rang off the post and went off my pad and off the post. Whew. Close moment there. Okay, we need a clear. And they wanted Alexiak will get it out. Thank you. Still got plenty of time on the power play. We really don't need to give up a third goal here. Oh, off the blocker. That was a rocket. Keatley will steal that. Get it to the point. To Gilbert. Kick save. Huge rebound. Almost cleared out my, my team. Oh, one-timer deflected. Tricky. Made the save. Okay, finally cleared it. I'm moving well and getting into position pretty well. It's just all... Oh, Heatley. Okay. He, oh, boy. <laughs> Bounced off the boards and came back out. I thought Heatley was going to come in a little long, more and instead of just slapping that. He would have had a better chance. And Setaguchi is offside. Get a face-off with Minnesota having six seconds on the power play. 2.35 left in the second. We won the face-off, but Ben got ran over. Lost it. I'll clear it. Lowy Erickson must have been the one with the penalty because he came flying out of that penalty box. There's Pominville. Slap her on. I'll cover that. Let's see who is that. Koivu coming right down. Yep. Didn't want him getting a chance. 136 left. Let's see if we can win this. They will and give it right up. I don't know if that was wide or if that was... A. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> I have no words when stuff happens like that. It's just making noises. That's my mouth. <laughs> Dying seconds. Still 2-1 Minnesota. So, just... It's a rough game for us. I mean, it's actually a really good game. Badly... Bad turnovers in the defensive end, and I have a B plus in positioning. Wow! But we've done so good offensively, and only one goal to show for the 27 shots. Minnesota sure came out with more shots, and I have 18 saves. They are out hitting us quite a bit. That might be why we're they're forcing the turnovers. I don't know. Third period, we need a goal without giving up anything. Preferably two goals without giving up anything. I haven't had an overtime, actually, in a long time. Oh! Okay, get rid of that. 
I'm moving well while down. Usually, I tend to not move very much while down. At, and just being cautious of not moving too much and sliding way out. But I think I'm moving really well. I mean, that's one of many times that he has been laid out on the ice tonight. Ben gets that pass intercepted. Here comes Jason Pominville, former Buffalo Saber. We'll snap that on, but easy save for me. Nobody there for the rebound. Louis Erickson breaks his stick on a slapper. Harding gets that out, and here comes Setaguchi. He'll dump that in. Pretty back and forth so far. Sheetley will go in on the four check and get that. Setaguchi almost had a chance, but just in too tight. Matt Frazier, backskate a bit, lose the puck. Morrow got it, kept it alive. Slapper saved off of Alexiak, and Rister saved off of Alexiak. Oh, we have got to solve Harding. He's already done his Maybe get some guys in front. Lead. Absolutely. I mean, they've got enough. Get some traffic. Try to deflect it. Something. Alexiak got his shot blocked. Blocks. Erickson in try to get it. Ben will get it. And get bumped. And uh, lost it. Zucker. <laughs> we'll dump it in. Coyle has it. Going around. Pass to the point. Oh, what a give and go, and nobody covering again. Man, I'm just grateful they have not had any offense hardly going. This could easily be like an eight-goal ga game. It's just Morrow again in the middle of that, just looking confused. Literally, in the middle of that, he did not cover anybody. And 3-1 to one Minnesota, they are stealing this game. No, scratch that. Harding is stealing this game. That's what I want to be one day. A game stealer. Or stealer. A game thief. How about that? That's better. Pass up that wing side to Emerton. This is Emerton. We can still get two goals, but we need something to change. Like, Harding to get injured. I don't know. Getting to walk right in, but lost the puck. At least they did something. Defense is just backskating, allowing him to walk right in. And Frazier, I don't know what he's doing, but he's getting double teamed. Maybe a bit of interference Peverly did right there. Nothing called. Comes Parise. Trying to work around Morrow, unable to. I thought Morrow has done pretty well this season, but he has not had a good game in this one. Jason, it's so disappointing. One goal off of that many shots and make it two. Who was that? Peverly. We'll get us back into this one. It's 12th of the season. See, that's what I'm talking about. Get some traffic in front, deflect it, whatever. Well, we would be tied if hadn't given up that other goal. I got to try to be a little more alert and ready for those opportunities they're going to get. Mainly for those uh, turnovers. Erickson will slap that on. I really wish he would stop doing that so often. He's got the skills. Try to deke around somebody or something. Wait, for some reason, the AI just thinks, oh, I'll just slap it on after entering the zone every time. It's Connaughton to Klingberg, who is like only like 68 overall. I looked at our AHL squad. We have better players down there. The AI... Management doesn't want to do anything, though. I don't know. Dumped in. Getting down to about five minutes left. Erickson will get that. He's been out an awfully lot this game. And we're offside with 5-10 remaining. 
3-2 game. At least it's close. Josh Harding has done an amazing job. Faceoff will come near our blue line. Goligoski will dump it in. Gotta get to work here. Brad Malone after it. He's getting bumped off the puck and lost it. Nobody able to get it. Danny Heatley will shoot that on. Get his own rebound and get pinned by Larson. Goligoski will poke that free and skate out. Alex Goligoski all the way from our end. Back behind the goal line, but lost it. We need to keep that puck moving. They're double teaming the puck carrier. Heatley, another slapper on. Couldn't get that, and he scores. I tried not to hug the post because I felt like it would throw me off, but I probably should have. Man, I hate those wraparounds. And it's four to two. If the goalie covering was just better, I would have had that. I would have rather grab it and have a face off. That's probably going to be the put away goal, especially with how Harding's playing. And that'll go into the neutral zone. Spurgeon over to Pominville. Shot on. Easy save. Last minute of play. Oh! Is that a save? Or was that a miss? I don't know, but I got a cross for it. Should be pulling goalie. Yep. Get off. Okay. Maybe a miracle can happen. <laughs> Not looking likely now. Parise will miss it. Alexiak will send it around. Morrow gets bumped off. Parise to Suter, and he scores. Five to two. And that will do it. That's 29.1 seconds left. Disappointing defensive effort. And a great offensive effort. They kind of slowed down and did not get the results. Probably should have. 15 seconds. Erickson's control of the puck right there. That's unusual tonight. Gary, he's a big and Harding will hold on to that for the faceoff. This is going to hurt us again in that playoff race. We cannot string together any wins. And this is a home game. We should have played much better. Dying seconds. Minnesota's just going to play a little keep away. Eakin, Emerton, Goligoski, shot. Lock and it's over. That's it. Dallas has Josh Harding, you know, you don't congratulations and amazing performance by him. Got an A minus in positioning. I'm surprised at that. Kind of weird. Good night. Five to two, the final. They did have 30 shots, but I did allow four goals. I mean, just, uh, I don't know. Oh, I hope we're not going to have more games like that with my defense. Just so many guys out. Uh, Sanguinetti, I think, was coming back pretty soon, was I? I don't remember. <laughs> I shouldn't try to think of stuff. Three goals in the last period for them. One was an empty nether, though. If I just could have kept those two out. Coulda, shoulda, woulda, whatever. 86.2 for, that's about what my numbers are. And we will look at playoff standings, see if my team wins in the games. Kari Lettinen starting. Not much experience for that. Really felt like it should have been a better game. Leaves a bad taste in the mouth.
We're about the same record, too. So we really gotta start winning some. It doesn't help that we've had so many injuries. That's no excuse. And I will start next game, too. Hmm. Against Calgary. Get benched for Phoenix. Start against Calgary again. Start against Toronto. Maybe because we're, like, slipping. Maybe they're trying to put me in that more. I don't know why I've started so many. But I'm surprised. If I keep starting this many, there might be two more episodes before the end of the season. Uh, no upgrades. Look if my career statistics have changed. I really want to get some more wins. 3.93, 86.4 save percentage. Really terrible. It's like my sophomore slump. I really thought this season was going to be so much better. From the uh, preseason, it was awesome. So, Daly's out till May 6th. Dylan's out till April 10th. Nemeth is out till March 9th. Sanguinetti's out till March 25th. A lot of these guys are out for a while. Daly's not coming back unless we have playoffs. Even then, he'll be out till like a round or two. I don't know. Uh, Dylan, I don't think, will come back until playoffs either. Where's April? Well, he'll come back just before the end of the season. But yeah. Still in February. Right about the date now. That's weird. <laughs> just a little creepy. Uh, let's just look at the standings and then I'll probably wrap it up. Uh, we have 53 games played now. Western Conference slipped to 12th now. Uh, eighth is now 60 points. We do have three games in hand, but if we can't win these games, we're not going to ever catch them. I mean,. Thinking on the bright side, if we win those three games, we'll be only three points out, but we can't string together some wins. It's been very tough. So, I don't know. We'll just have to really, 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 really try harder. I don't know. It's rough without those defensemen that we've counted on for playing at least okay defense but oh well um our offense is still doing pretty decent anyways uh hopefully one or two more episodes left in the season then we should have either playoffs or season wrap up and then i'll start my next season which will be my fourth in this goalie be a pro mode and hopefully i can keep up the same pace Anyways, guys, if you liked the video, uh, please like, comment, and or subscribe. That helps me. And I'm AvalancheFam133, and I will talk to you guys later.